be okay Tbiant Stevyant so many Hi guys today we are doing something different so thank you for watching my previous videos and for those of you who haven't subscribed please do not forget to click the subscribe button so for today we are doing um i know di ko dapat gagawin to dahil maraming sa inyo nagre-request sa akin kasi uh two weeks ago sometimes two weeks ago tevian was being featured in one of my idols videos which is money mua yes i've been following money mua yung uh, during the starting of his uh, YouTube uh, uh, career before and then um, I know some of my friends and then some of the people knows that I love Mani Mua so much and then being uh, uh, when Tevian being featured uh, to his uh, video it was really you know parang uh, a dream come true for me and then nanginginik buong katawan ko it's so surreal for me and then ang dami sa inyo nagre-request na kung or nagtatanong ko anong reaction ko or uh, how do I feel and then what uh, what do I think about the video and blah 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 so today um, I'm trying to watch it again to, in front of you guys and of course we will recreate also the look that he did for that specific video and uh, without waiting let's start and uh, if you want to make sabai with me to do the steps and then I uh, encourage you to pick up your makeup pouch or makeup gadget or makeup tools and then follow every step that we are doing and syempre hindi lang Tevian na feature sa video nito ng, uh, none others than uh, the rest of the local brands here in the Philippines and I'm so happy that kahit pa paano um, uh, a legit international beauty guru or beauty influencers really giving a review not only for Tevian but also for the rest of the Philippines makeup brand. It's time to celebrate the local brands that we have here in the Philippines. And pasensya na po kung may nasabi ako ng uh, side comments na hindi masyadong maganda para sa inyo because I will try not to filter all the comments and all my thoughts for this video because I'm going to give an honest uh, opinion or honest comments so that for you guys to really understand how I feel about this video what I like to talk also definitely uh, I don't have lahat yung produkto yung na feature or nagamit ni Mani Mua but I will try to um, alter it to according uh, the products that I have here at home and I try to uh, catch up also on whatever look or color na, na achieve niya. So let's start! excited about today's video because I'm doing the Philippines <gasps> and I'm so excited because honestly like growing up I had a Filipino best friend so like I'm just like living for this so hard right now in high school I love Filipino food you know pansin and lumpia and ube bread and things like that not that any of those things will be in this but I just oh my god alam mo uh, before I come to the Philippines before pansit lumpia lumpia Shanghai yung mga ganun yung one of those must try Filipino food talaga and you know to whoever yung best friend niya Filipino good job in introducing the real Filipino culture through its food oh my god this box is by oh. far the biggest box I've gotten and it's the heaviest box I've gotten this is probably 20 pounds when I tell you guys I was shocked at how big this was I was like are you kidding me it's so heavy like what could you fit in here it's insane like what if, if okay oh we have lippies oh she organized for me it's fucking organized. This is the lippy section. <laughs> you suspended in disbelief. I know you didn't send me 15 lip products, Jasmine. I'm officially slightly overwhelmed. So we have three eyeshadow palettes in this little bag. Wait, but why is this like so freaking cute? I thought it worked that you went to this, Jasmine. Like, honestly, I'm shook by this. This little guy is like cute little like pinky moment. This is from Squad. Very I haven't squad tried Squad. I know. Honestly, I want to try. I, I have no words. Like, I'm literally just so happy about this. this Eyeshadow palette right here. Okay, ah. cute. Loose mineral foundation. It's attached with a bag. No shine 
mattifier with salicylic acid, and then it comes with BLK Cosmetics Multitasking Color Stick, SPF Mattifying Sunscreen Powder. I'm very like intrigued because it's just everything's so different than what I'm used to. Like I'm not used to the way these things are laid out. It's so different to me. Foundation, the foundation. In fairness kay Jasmina, ang effort niya mag zip lock one by one and per category. Oh my god, nakakakilig naman. You have highlighters, a variety of highlighters, four different highlighters, eyeliner and eyebrow products. Nakikita ko tayo yan. Oh my god. We have full blown several pairs of lashes and a little brow product. I think these are more lip products right here. Ang dami ng lipstick. I'm so overwhelmed. I'm like getting, I'm blushing from being overwhelmed. Oh my God, hindi lang siya nag-overwhelm. Ako yung manunood. Parang even me, when I'm watching it, parang nakakikilig talaga. Lalo na kung to expect na a fans creating those kind of box. Oh my God, parang ang effort. A for effort kay Jasmine. A brush set. It looks really nice. By Ann Klutz brushes. Ann Klutz. Full-blown eye brush and face brush set. Holy crap, blushes. No, 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 no. Multi purpose lippies. Do you know what I feel like? I feel like this is Mary Poppins' motherfucking purse. And I just keep pulling out more and more. And we have a luxury eyeliner eyelash magnetic lash kit. I haven't tried Full that. Lash. We have this primer from BLK Cosmetics, multitasking color stick, and it's completely clear. And it's basically just a mattifying primer. So I'm supposed to just put it on the I'll face. try this one. And it absolutely matters. Look at that. It's like the shine that was on my forehead is completely gone. You can see this? How it's literally just erasing the shine from my face. What? Okay, so it seems like a very like kind of poor. So mattifying stick, parang primer. Parang ano siya, kadop niya, if I can say, uh, dati meron sa NARS na mattifying uh, ano nila. That was my favorite, favorite, favorite primer nung nasa NARS Philippines pa rin ako. Yes, I used to work for NARS Philippines. And then, um, yeah, it feels like this. Oh. I mean, it looks dry, pero when you touch it, it's very moisturizing. So basically, I'm just spreading it using my finger. Filling type primer. I know there's a lot of BLK products in here, so I'm assuming that's a bigger brand in the Philippines. BLK. There's they are so very big. big. Oh really, my really god, man. There's, there's a ton of different brands. There's Happy Skin, She, BLK, Teviant, Steviant. <laughs> so many. Let's go in with our foundation now. So, as she said, of course, we don't know about foundation yet, but we're going to try this out. This is the Sun Glow by Fresh Creme Tinted Sunscreen SPF 50. So, this guy like this reminds me of the It Cosmetics pack. Oh my god, I have right here. SPF 50, SPF 50. Okay. I can imagine it's like the same, same coverage. I would just scream. I would do two pumps of it on my skin. Oh my god, this is like cool like guys. Hair. So we're just gonna pray that it works. I'm gonna take this brush. Let's take a square with that. Okay. The Anne Klutz Flat Angled Kabuki. Okay, Flat Angled Kabuki. We're gonna try that onto the face. Let's take a bunch of that. Color wise, I think we're great. We're completely good on the color. Don't you worry, my sweet darling. Coverage wise, it doesn't have as much coverage as the <laughs> It Cosmetics CC Cream, but it feels so similar. It smells amazing, by the way, too. Actually, you know what? It smells like kind of like baby powder, but it smells really good. And the color is really nice. It fits me. I'm going to put a second layer on certain area. It's so light on the skin. I can't believe. But yun nga, as what Manny said, not much coverage, pero it's okay. So if you have a uh, flawless skin, this is a perfect for every day for you. Pero if you are like me now, we have a breakouts right now. Na hindi masyadong gifted yung skin natin ngayon. So there's need additional coverage also. Act more densely, for sure. But I think that, you know, for what it is, pretty good. Two pumps is covering my face like absolutely perfectly. Look at this! It's covering nicely. Like a nice medium coverage tinted foundation situation. All right. Okay, so we are very, see, we're back to dewy again. 
or we're, we're all the way back to Dewey, you know, use that mattifying stick and now we're here. But you know what, I think that it's a good thing because imagine if yes. we didn't use a mattifying thing. To there, balance everything, oh, 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 we mattifying the primer. In Korea, by the way, Koreans know their shit when it comes to skincare and SPF and that kind of vibe. That's what I'm really liking about this. It feels super healthy. It looks super healthy. The coverage is gorgeous. It's a nice medium coverage. It builds nicely. You can build this to be a little bit more than medium too. So I feel like I did build it up to me. The color is stunning. I'm very impressed with this. Me okay, too. Oh, oh, oh. So for concealer, we're gonna take the Elana Mineral Cosmetics. It's like a little concealer, like a cream. Oh shit! I was expecting it to be it. Oh my god, guys! I don't have that Elana's um concealer so i'm going to use my own concealer what uh, i have right now here is actually the infallible full wear uh, concealer so basically i'm going to spread it a little bit here <laughs> nilagay ko lang dyan guys kasi ano uh, may mga breakouts ako dyan so Manny is using this brush from Mami Unclothes, so I'm using it also. Ito yung mga, ito yung lag, latest collection na ta, ni Unclothes brush. So alam mo in fairness sa Unclothes brush, um, I think I already have three series of it, and then so far I like it, and then it do the job. So basically, I'm just blending in using my uh, beauty blender or beauty sponge that's so far yung nagawa ko ngayon make it work kahit magkaiba yung kulay sa mukha tsaka yung sa ano, concealer Anyway, let's continue. Glassy appearance to my skin. It's kind of darling. It's very darling. This is not like my normal. This is not my go-to. I just set my face, you know, make sure everything's like- Me too. <laughs> I, I just don't know this will last very long on my face. Without it being set, so we're gonna use a lot of powder to set our face. We have these two, I put them, I think from the packets, I put them in here. But I don't know what Kelly's gonna be me, but we're gonna have try. one in chai tea latte. She said this is like a pretty, like, dense powder, so I don't know if we're gonna go crazy with it right away. We're just gonna kind of lightly try to kill color. Oh lord. We're gonna take a fluffy brush and we're gonna go ahead and fluff that into our face. We're gonna do a very I'm going to blend it lang. Alam mo yung Elana powder to? I mean, I tried once before. And then right now, I'm trying it again. I mean, it has coverage pala, guys. So, it's really intense yung powder niya. So, you might want to be careful. Kasi, I think if you can put... Uh, for me, if I... If I have to use this one, maybe I will not use it on top of any foundation or any uh, concealer. Just use the as a powder, you know, parang how you guys do a baby powder things. You know, like uh, put in a brush and then lang ganon. I think it's better because right now it's too thick for your for my face. Guys, intense talaga yung Elana powder. Kahit napatungan ko ng ano, ng ibang powder hindi siya naka blend maayos sige habulin ko na lang siya look at how this powder is really full coverage natakpan niya yung mga breakouts ko Nahabul ko na yung color. Okay, now since we have too much powder naman, I'm going to spray na lang muna with my favorite uh, face mist from Fresh Skin Lab. This is to rehydrate and to restore. This is the one in aloe vera and antioxidant. This technique is really good also if you really want to have a lot of coverage. Pero at the same time, tandaan nyo guys. Habul natin yung uh, fuller coverage through powder products. 
kasi very humid here in the Philippines mga ibang beauty influencers locally they like to use mga cream and liquid kasi mas madali gamitin at the same time also after shooting the video they don't probably have to go out with that makeup so hindi naman kailangan isipin na kung long lasting pero if you are on the go and always sa labas na always look for an option to have a powder product to cover so actually yun nga yung Elana uh, maganda siya if you're like that if you need a fuller coverage pero at the same time na uh, ayaw niya yung super oily or ano ang ganda yung produkto niya pero since na foundation na tayo ngayon and concealer so that's why kailangan natin na yung subtle lang yung powder and skin finish pero kanina kung hindi tayo gumamit ng foundation ng ano pwede natin gamitin yung loose powder ni Elana kasi super intense loose powder niya uh, very full coverage hindi ko inexpect ganun siya almost like ano siya eh, powder foundation eh so very good with this again we have some Issy and Co cream this Meron was crazy these colorette shake me up real good Lily so these are like a oil you put on your face and your eyes and your lips but it's like a t it's like a little tint right it's like a really intense tint very really intense again. but it's like you can use it on the face okay that in holy crap it's so pigmented but it's like so lightweight look at that it blended like perfection color right white so i want to use one on that side and then try maybe the issy and co on this side this is definitely a bunch Ayan. of intense gnarly cream product it's not like greasy feeling it's very like intense and like it's dense that one's obviously more pink this one's a little more of like a apricot this one's more pink but look how effortlessly that blended Jackson was saying that these products are like for I'm going to use my finger if you want me to uh, have a review on these products I posted it a couple of weeks ago and you might want to check them out on my thoughts about these products and then basically you know this is just something that you have to or you can use it for every day because uh, you know like the color and the pigment is really for everyday lang, for everyday girl lang. Uh, pero at the same time na kailangan natin na i-build and we build to according to the consistency or to the uh, pigments that we want to achieve. But then again guys, here in the Philippines, anything na cream or liquid, if you want to use, go ahead. Pero at the same time, do not forget to set it with powder, which I believe that money will do the same thing also later on. So therefore, I'm using this Ooh. intense. Lenga natin yan. Tinga natin han ano yung reaction ni Mani. And cheek, and like they're very very multi-use products. So that's really really popular in the Philippines for people that like just don't want to like spend so much time doing the makeup, but just want to toss something on on several spots. It's super super popular in the Philippines. Is what? Oh nga no, bakit? Ano, napansin niya rin yun eh. Lahat, most of the brand is really into the multitasking ano products here. Pero alam nyo guys, um, well, I have no comment naman uh, in terms of the products like that. Pero I'm teaching you guys lang na it's always nice uh, to have uh, products na specifically for for the lips. Para it really cater what the, the lips needs. And then, yung consistency sa lips naman, hindi rin ano, maganda for the skin sometimes. Kasi it's too heavy and sometimes it can really clog the pores. So obviously this side you can see like there's more of a pop on this side again impressed i'm impressed with their cream products as well i'm very very impressed with the cream situation and i'm not really a cream girl That's me also me. but it's going with those moves. me also i'm not a cream person also kasi yun nga kasi ang bigat niya sa skin and then consistency sa skin is not really nice also at the same time mas mahirap i-control yung makeup lalo na kung lumabas kayo sa labas ng aircon yung or uh, sa araw, sa initang araw ang hirap i-control niya to stay to let the product stay really long so right now, moving on on the highlighter so I'm going to use this uh, highlighters, the one that I have from Tevian, of course um, I'm using this in resin so I'm going to use this here And I'm using the blurring powder which is on top of the pan or the upper pan under the eyes because it's really 
um, it doesn't really give those kind of shine that you're looking for but it's more on the opaque kind of shine so it's blurring away all the eye bags that you have and the lines tingnan nyo kita nyo yung may glow pero subtle lang siya hindi yung sumigaw sumigaw um, if you guys been following me on Instagram or some of my work, you guys know that I like to base my blush on with a pink tone of uh, highlighters. So when I have Tevian, it's one of the must color that we have in the highlighters. And I know most of you are being surprised by it pink tone, but I like it because uh, this is uh, I've been explaining to some people it, to achieve those really uh, natural inner kind of glow. And then using the the blurring powder which is upper pan I'm going to swipe it a little bit like that lang. I don't have that Mooney I will get some so I can really try it and that it's very intense very intense right away I'm assuming it's going to dry to a powdery finish using these kind of products do. Look at that. It just blends perfectly in. It's like, it has coverage to it. So be careful with that. I'm going to go ahead and overlay the products we have going on. This is the Tebeyond Blush. To Ayan blush. Na. So we have blush duo. And we have almost have like a bronzery type duo. So we're going to go ahead and put those on the face too and see what we think. Just to kind of solidify the makeup that we have in place, you know? Especially because with that powder, it's going to kind of dilute the color and even and also set the cream powder, uh, the cream products. Gorgeous. Wow, those are extremely very Oh. Holy crapola. Punch that into. Oh my god. I'm taking a little bit of bronzer brush, this one here. I'm going to dip that into this color. I'm nervous. It's a little powdery. I'm just going to run that into the temples. Nice. It's like a shimmery one and a matte one. This brand, Tiviant, it's like all over the places. It's all over my boxes in here. They must be like a really big brand because wow. there's so much stuff that I have in here that's from this brand. Like I'm really impressed. Seriously. Kinikilik talaga ako yung ano yung blush kasi um blush palette of our ano uh, uh, cheek palette of Tiviant is actually one of the hardest one to develop. These cheek products kasi super uh, roller coaster during the development because we want to pick the right color uh, we want to pick the right consistency and the right coverage or the, the right color release with the uh, so much uh, improvement from the factory so we decided to press uh, each products on a certain level of uh, pressure lamp because it has a little bit of moist, a little bit of active ingredients, which is uh, very potent. So in Tisha, puede it press ng todo, because it will kill or ruin the um, particle of the uh, skincare inside this product. So I'm using the color of uh, Mykonos. So if you are uh, not yet familiar with uh, the Deviant, uh, contour palette so we have two pan the upper pan is uh, the matte finish one and then the lower pan is the bronzing powder so we need to have a uh, contour it softly using the matte powder right now I'm using a blush on of Tevian blush on parin and the shades of uh, rosette because I want to blend everything in uh, to make everything blend together so I'm going to blend everything all the highlighters and the contour that we have I'm bringing up a little bit here because I know some of you uh, like to put here highlighters but I'm going to blend together with the highlighters so I'm going to bring it up para may illusion na umangat yung face goal kasi 34 years old na ako so may laugh line na ako so I don't want to concentrate here so I'm going to bring it upward here para mukhang umangat at mukhang mas manipis yung face goal that area I also have this Tiviant Glow to Glass highlighter. Duo. I am in resin. I don't really like this one. 
It just feels like it's a little glittery. That one I'll say I don't really like. So far, like this is like the only thing that I was like looking at that I was like. Okay. Um, ina expect ko naman talaga na hindi niya magugustuhan kung that's resin and based on the photo or video that he's opening is resin. That's the one that we use. Hindi niya magugustuhan kasi uh, sanay sila sa mga sa US and uh, or sa ibang bansa or beauty influencers na with those placado placado na highlighters. But then again, um, uh, when you open uh, Tevian resin, it's really it's very kind of subtle. Um, hindi super makinang. Pero kung sana man lang na kung gustong gusto niya na super placado that's the one that we have in astral yung super makinang super glossy super high shine or high glass as in super duper uh, kuminang pero resin is something that you can wear for every day so as expected ayo niya talaga yung ganun color and uh, it's okay it's okay okay guys so we have several different brown products we have some stuff from tv on this is like the powder duo we have this product, but I was kind of like, okay, this precision eyebrow tint. It gives eyebrow tint. That new benefit product. It's so the, the, the three tongues that gives you like that little thing. However, the problem with this is that the color of it is actually like an olive green. And uh, it's I'm dark very green. confused as to why it's a green brow tint. Um, I don't know. But the product that I thought was like, whoa, this is really cool. It's from Issyan Co. Cosmetics. This brow refiner thing. Issyan Co. Eyebrow Gel and Castor Oil. This is an eyebrow mascara. Ah, oh, hindi yung ginawa yung eyebrow duo. Yun pa naman yung pambato na pangkila ko and the eyebrow tint. To make your brows like grow healthy, like at nighttime while you're sleeping, maybe. But the fact that it's like a castor oil and brow mascara on the other side, that was kind of cool. That's such a unique. I haven't thing. tried I that. I use Issyan Co. My brows. I'm assuming it helps your brows grow or hydrate them. I'm not exactly sure. We also have this product by also Tiniant. This is an eyebrow Oh my god. So careful, the careful. The... Ayan, sabi ko na, dinaray chow niya eh. Brown. It's like kakita brown. Oof. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dinaray chow niya kasi. Hey. <laughs> I don't like it. Can you take this little brush that I came with? Maybe just the product disbursement isn't good. You know? It's going to look a little bit more real or natural-ish with... A disbursement that looks better, but that looks I like have a, have a redhead brow. See? Okay. Okay, let's talk about it, guys. Um, well, the Tevian eyebrow products. Oh my God, nandun na sa kanyang eyebrow duo ng Tevian, pero hindi niya ginamit and the eyebrow tint. Oh my God, I'm 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 dying to see him using those eyebrow duo powder and the eyebrow tint because those two are really uh the top two talaga yes top two talaga na i can't uh work without you know like uh it's really the formulation that i want to cater for the uh asian people because uh, it's really humid here as being a makeup artist in the bridal industry for quite some time and really long um naiinis ako kung na effort ako sometimes you know i i really take my time to create a good eyebrow because eyebrows is everything and set the face and give the look also and then you know by the time nasa church siya nawawala or na fade out yung eyebrow because the eyebrows uh skin of the bride is really oily may mga ganun tao guys super oily talaga and then that's why when I create Tevian, I really want to give you know a product that's really sweat proof, oil proof, and those kind of things para to help me to overcome that situation when when I have a makeup geek sa, sa bridal. So um, finally we have those uh, formulation. Gagawin ko na lang siya sa harapan yung ulit guys, kasi the eyebrow powder duo is really something that I like a lot and sayang din niya na try but anyway it's okay it's okay it's okay and uh being featured sa video news already a huge 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 dream come true so and i'm so happy na how fair he is in reviewing products from the philippines meaning like hindi stick siya sa isang brand walang favor siya sa any brand and then yun yung sabi ko professionalism like uh it's really giving chance to all the brands that he has so right now after I brush the ano, I'm going to use my eyebrow tint. Muna yung sabi niya color is uh, uh, olive green is I think this one. This is the darkest one. Hindi kita. Kita ba guys? Yan. Na hindi ko alam bakit sabi niya olive green. Pero this one is gray brown. So this is the one that we want for those natural eyebrows. Can you see? It's real. I'm going to feel yung mga kalbo part of my eyebrows 
so if you want to achieve natural looking of eyebrow this is already enough but syempre gusto natin yung plakado yung eyebrow kasi eyebrow is really eyebrows on flick is life so tingnan look at the difference kasi ito may butas butas mga ganun yung may part na kalbo pero uh, when you use this one it's actually filling in the gaps and then moving on I'm using the eyebrow duo this one in highness pakita ko sa inyo bakit love na love ko to na sayang din niya ginamit so I'm using the uh, darker color muna on the outer part of the eyebrows so I'm using this uh, to really make everything mas malinis and mas defined I like my eyebrow thick I like my eyebrows really thick but then again I'm going to use the eyebrow gel um, Kanina when, when he used this one sinasabi ko careful careful kasi hindi sila sanay sa ganitong formulation kasi sanay sila yung ano yung coated lang pero very sheer yung product kasi just because na um, okay their feature is already mestizo mestiza so uh, si Manny yung buhok niya is black pero most of them karamihan are blonde or ano so when they use already lightly coated na eyebrow products it's really uh, get the look right away pero tayo mga Asian so kasi most of us having a colored hair so we want to have a full coverage on the eyebrows naman so there that's why I created this one is really matte finish and really uh, full coverage to be able to cover the entire hair kasi kung hindi ka sanay with this kind of consistency which is most of the one in the market is very sheer lang so this is very intense and full coverage na eyebrow products. So there you go. Brow. Okay. I'm just gonna stop the other side. I should have. I like this brow better. Mm, I do. <laughs> this one is just it's more filled, you can see, but it's yes. just it's a little intense for me. You know it's, what? We're good. It's very intense talaga, guys. Oh, okay. okay. so let's go with this little coverage. shout shout. This is from Squad. I'm assuming that's the brand, it just says squad on it. Very squad shadow palette. The squad palette, the mats were rough, but I swatched the TDL palette and the mats were better. But I've just been using so much of that brand that I don't want to keep using the same things over and over again. See, fair so talaga siya eh. First, and see kind of what we can get from here. I'm gonna go in with this palette first. Like the vibes wise, this gives me higher end vibes for the Philippines. And this the queen gives me more palette. vibes. So I'm not sure exactly if that's correct or I'm not exactly sure. You guys, you have to look it up down below. But yeah, I mean, the shadows are just, you know, after... Uh, two layers you can get there, but I'm not really a huge fan of this palette. This little paleta quality isn't very good. Okay, so let's go with this little Niet shade. So look at that, look at that. Look at that, look at that intensity. Look at that, look at that. That's what I was looking for. That's what I do. Look at that. Oh my let's god. Go. Let's put that in. That's like really good. It's like really intense. <laughs> Oh, wow, okay. So, but see, the problem with these is that the shimmers, feeling them, like they're it's okay. Basic. The shimmers of the other, the smaller palette, like this one, the squad palette is, okay, I wasn't prepared for the amount of pigmentation that's happening right here. I'm ruining my eyebrow. Let's save the edges a little bit. I don't know if it's saveable. Oh, I don't know. It's like this like maroon shade I swatched originally, and it's like this like foily one from the squad palette. Put that on to the lid. See, it's like pretty intense, it's like foiled. It's like a foily shade. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. It's a little chunky, it's a little intense, but you know, for what it is, it's not bad. Okay. 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 So now I'm going to replicate or redo that uh eye makeup because to be honest, uh Tevian eyeshadow palette is very basic. I mean like uh when I created a uh, Tevian uh eyeshadow palette, yes we have those advanced um eyeshadow formulation na hindi pa namin nalabas in the public pero when we introduce the brand to the market it's always nice to have the best uh, version of basic so we have a basic uh, matte eyeshadows uh, we have a basic 
eyeshadow, uh, frosted eyeshadows because that's why yung sabi niya yung shimmer niya. And then sanay, sanay na siya ngayon with uh, those uh, metallic uh, or glossy kind of uh, shimmered eyeshadow. Pero uh, bring back to those early 2000 na kind of frosted eyeshadow. This is the one for Tevian because I want to give everything basic muna for the first collection of the eyeshadows. So I'm using the same uh, color, ni from the Queen eyeshadow palette. So basically, he just put it here on the crease area and then bring it forward. Guys, if you notice bakit yung sabi niya yung Tevian basic eyeshadow or matte eyeshadow is very intense. The same thing also with the shimmered one just because... Um, the formulation itself is really uh, a very innovative kind of uh, formula that uh, somehow it's really giving uh, parang an effect of eye primer and uh, eyeshadow into one. So kahit walang kayo eyeliner or eye primer, it's already uh, the eyeshadow will really stay there and stay long. So the same thing also on the other side. I'm going to do the same eyeshadows for him. All right, I'm going to finish the eyes and then we'll come back to you guys. Since I don't have a uh, quads uh, cosmetic, so I'm going to use a uh, Huda Beauty na lang. This one in pink diamond. Ayan. Ayan na guys. So right now I'm going to use another uh, lashes. Today I'm going to use this one from Lashi. Uh, this is a 3D lashes. Advanced foam mink lashes. Mimic the quality of finance of real mink lashes. Oh my god. Ang ganda. Wait lang. You have to see this guys. 3D talaga siya. Oh my God. Isang lashes lang yan ha. Ayan na. Tapos na yung eye makeup natin. Kaso parang uh, iba kasing lumabas sa mata niya. Kasi ang ganda yung kulay ng mata niya. So ngayon, to make a little bit ano lang, bounce ng ilaw sa mata ko. I'm going to use the Tevian uh, Glitter Liner in Arjan, the silver one. I'm going to put it under the eyes lang. Nakita nyo guys, ang ganoon. Para to have a little bit of glow lang. So for those of you who haven't tried the uh, Tevin Lip Spell, you guys might want to check them out. Kasi especially ngayon, we have to take care of the lips underneath those facial masks. And it tastes so good. It smells so good. Parang gusto nyo kainin. Alright. So, this is the look, I guess. Let's play. Okay, guys. And that is it. I used my entire Philippines mystery box. A full face of Filipino makeup here on the face. What do you guys think? How do you guys think it turned out? Okay, for the lip gloss, since I don't have that lip gloss from Fresh with me here. So, I'm using the... Anastasia uh, Parfait Lip Gloss Then I'm going to put a little bit of uh, another gloss from uh, NARS There you go So ayan na guys, as you guys can see, ito na yung final product to na parang butch ako, naka beard siya Parang mano yung sa, ano, sa Greatest Showman, Beard Lady. Parang ko si Beard Lady. Na, anyway. Well, baka siguro next time magma-makeup ako, i-shave ko dito. No, kung gusto nyo i-shave ko dito, please comment in the comment box below. Malay mo, I changed my mind and i-shave ko talaga siya, guys. And then, by the way, thank you for watching. And ito na po yung final result. Yung na-recreate ko ulit yung uh, makeup look na gawa ni Mani Mua for the uh, mystery box from the Philippines. So thank you so much, Jasmine, for including Tevian 
to be part of your mystery box to uh, money of course it's a dream come true not only for Tevin but also from me because it's been uh, he's been my idol ever since matagal na um, dati dati pa na hindi ko uh, na alala kung anong year exactly pero yun I've been following his Instagram his uh, YouTube and watching all his video and definitely to be there the products that I developed to be there is really um, parang unbelievable and so surreal yung feeling niya so ito na po yung itsura ng look natin mm. and then thank you for watching and do not forget to comment on the comment box below or to give me suggestion if what kind of video that I should do or kung may gusto specific makeup that you want me to re recreate or to um, make a reaction uh, please comment also on the comment box below malay mo hindi lang natin gagawa ng um, international beauty guru baka we can do also for the local uh, celebrity or local beauty guru comment on the comment box below and definitely I can't wait to see if you guys can recreate this look and tag me on my Instagram and of course Twitter and of course uh, for those of you who haven't tried Tevian please check Tevian in the Tevian Las Mall and of course um, uh, shopping mall also of Tevian and for those of you stayed abroad or outside the Philippines you guys can enjoy all the promos that we have from the tevianbeauty.com yes www.tevianbeauty.com and we have international shipping also and we deliver to wherever you are and definitely thank you again for watching and yes i love the lashes so much and the lipstick thank you so much i'll see you on my next video